Okay, this is a rotation on a coordinate plane 180 degrees about the origin. The way I'm going to tell you to do this is to actually rotate your paper 180 degrees. And you that means that your paper will be upside down when you finish with that rotation. So now you notice that all the numbers, the negatives are up here and the positives are down here and then positives are here and the negatives are to the right. And that is not the way it's supposed to be because everything has been switched. So you have to kind of ignore those numbers. Um, so now this A, B, and C will now become your prime. This is your answer um, when, when you go ahead and take the coordinates of the primes and turn your paper back that will be your answer so a prime will now go will be three to the right and two down three to the right would be a positive three two down would mean negative two so those are the coordinates for a prime b prime doesn't go right or left so that will stay zero and then it goes down six so anytime that you go down six it is a negative six c you're going to the left one every time you go to the left on the x-axis that's a negative and down four that's on the y-axis and that is a negative four once you have all your coordinates, you are ready to, to turn your paper back to the original way, up, right side up, and then plot your new prime points. You have three, negative two down here for A prime, and label it A prime as soon as you put that point down. Z B prime is zero, negative six. So that would be down here, 0 and 6 down, and label it B prime. C prime is negative 1, negative 4, 1 to the left and 4 down. And that is C prime. The next thing you will do is to connect your points A to B to C and back to A again. And that would be A prime, B prime, and C prime. That is your rotation of a figure 180 degrees.